and the 2024 baseball season is underway. This ball ripped. Diving play to his right. Flores comes up. Long throw. Crop. How about that? Welcome, Jalen Flores, to the 40 acres. With a couple here on the alumni side, but he's going to stretch completely out there. Gets rid of it quick. I see Jared Thomas now at first base. Sometimes you're not going to have a feel for one. This ball back up the middle into center. Hamilton does not advance to third, but runners at first and second here. On the ground, this is into left for a base hit. Here comes Hamilton to the plate. He will score one nothing alumni. Walks come back to bite you. Throw to first, he gets away from Thomas. This is down into the corner. Clements on his way to the plate. Throw to the plate by Casparino, not in time. 2-0 alumni. And hit off of his handle of his bat. It's a fair ball. Throw to first in time. Rip that ball into the corner. That's going to go for extra bases. Campbell scores. Tico into second base. Ball gets away, but not far enough. Backed up by Brown. And third hit of the inning. Look at that. Chopped on the ground to third. Powell with it. Long throw across the diamond. Scooped out by Thomas. That ends the inning. You can see it with a baseball. No telling where he's going. Upstairs, ball four. Good at bat. With the transfer portal and everything, that I'm, I'm impressed for Peyton Powell that, that he stayed here. On the ground. Hamilton to his left. Smooth as silk. Makes the play. Get an out when you can. Flores steps in. He made an outstanding play himself. Tagging up here. Man, Campbell. Try it. Throw to the plate. Here comes the throw. It is not in time. <laughs> and it's a 3 1 ball game. It's, it, it's white. Slider it misses some outside. Kind of shade underneath it. Crushes this ball to right. You can hang some laundry on that line drive. That was a rocket. Runners now at first and third. Checks the runners. That ball gets back to the screen. Bounces back quickly. Now advancing to second. Did he go? Yes, he did. And that ends the inning. That slider comes back. We don't have a ball here, but at this season, I'm going to get you to explain to some folks. This ball hit crisply on the ground. Diving to his right. Have we seen this a lot? Yes, we have. <laughs> Welcome back. Using the turf with the throw. The ball hit firmly by Schusler. You don't see that too often in an alumni game, getting on the turf and making the strong throw and a good scoop on the other end. <laughs> good pick on the other end as well. Yeah, back in the day, uh, just the second, second alumni game ever. Ball hit pretty well to left with some carry. Back at the wall. Get out of town. Murphy Staley, 4 to 1 alumni. Well, Murph got under that one, had some good hang time out there. Something Murph did a few times during his time here at Texas. That one just stays on the plate. Didn't go in, a nice uppercut right there. Kind of went down and got it. He wasn't sure right there that he got enough of it. But just kept carrying. Went between my legs and basically hit the dirt. Much like kind of that direction right there that <laughs> that one and Tico just hit. The next time I came to the plate, uh, the great, this ball chopped in the ground should be two. The second for one, a relay to first. Six, four, three, and a beauty. Ouch. Act like a slider. On the ground, this could be two. Bobbled at second. Go to first to get the out. Plantier steps in at first pitch. He hits Sanders. On the ground, could be two. To second for one. The relay to first. Those two guys can turn a double play. Plantier has thrown. He hitting again. 
He hit the first batter last inning. The payoff. Outside something working here now for the varsity. Nobody out in the frame. The payoff. There go the runners. This ball hit well to right with some carry. This ball. Get out of town, Peyton Powell. We're tied. You work the count. I mean, the good at bat from Powell right there after the hit batter and the walk. Last year, Peyton Powell with 10. A gritty going on down there in the dugout. The senior from Robinson, Texas. With one out. This ball ripped into left. Stayed with it. Drove it the other way. Drove in nearly 60 runs. Transfer hits this ball pretty well to right. Campbell looking at it. This back off the wall. O'Dowd on his way to third. And Brown has to hold it first. Dylan Campbell can still play right field. Holds that to a single. <laughs> right. Played it perfectly off the wall out there. Told set. There goes the runner. Pitches outside. Throw to second base. Not in time. The 2 2. Outside corner. Frozen with the fastball. Because he's thrown slider, 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 and now you got a fastball. You just dots the outside corner right there. Rips to right. This ball is down. This is going to score a couple. And just like that, the varsity with a five spot here in the bottom of the six. Take a six to four lead. Pinch ran for Sanders last time, and that was Sanders' spot. So you put Max Blue back in there. A hot left inning bat. Gets the knock right there. Rips this ball into center. Came into the inning, did the varsity with one hit on the day. They have five in the frame. On the ground. Valtini across the diamond. Nice play that ends the inning. But not before the varsity comes up with a five spot. He hits this ball well to center. Going back is Thomas. On the track, runs it down right up against the wall. You can't hit a ball much harder than that one. The 2 2. Outside corner, frozen for the strikeout for the alumni. First pitch swinging, singles to left. On the ground to second, this should do it. No doubt has it, throws to first. As University of San Diego comes in for three and then Houston Christian and, and then Cal Poly for three and then St. John. So you get those games out of the way and since you get 12 ball games and then it's for real when you get to Houston to take on LSU. Well, last time they played there against LSU, there were 26,000. It's so sold it, out already. Transfer from San Diego. Danville, California neighbor. Hits this ball well to right. And get out of town. Step in and drive it out of here. And immediately knows the horns up to left field. Wow. A 90 mile an hour fastball opposite field right there. Who he just pinch hit for a guy who had a three run home run his last time up, Peyton Powell. This fastball down the middle. It is down, but middle away, and wow, it's good power. Not much to that swing either. The 1 0. This ball hit well to center with some carry and Tico back playable puts it away and that ends the ball game. The varsity comes back. Zeke they score six unanswered to come away with the victory. A good day. The alumni were back. Uh, they lost. You want the varsity to win the start start off on a good, a good note. But it, this is what it's for. It's about the alumni.